In other news today, has new evidence been found to link the notorious BTK serial killer to more murders? Dennis Rader is serving life in prison after being convicted of 10 murders, but he's now been named the prime suspect in other unsolved murders. Here's Les Trent. A startling new twist in the notorious BTK serial killer case. Cops say BTK is now the prime suspect in the previously unsolved disappearance of a cheerleader. 16-year-old Cynthia Kinney, a high school junior, was last seen in 1976 at an Oklahoma laundromat that her family owned. Missing girl case baffles officials, reads this headline. It happened around the time BTK monster Dennis Rader was unleashing his reign of terror 120 miles away in Wichita. BTK stood for Bind, Torture, Kill, his trademark M.O. Raider, a Boy Scout volunteer, killed 10 people over a span of 17 years. He was finally brought to justice in 2005 and is currently serving multiple life sentences. Just this week, police have been digging up property that Raider once owned as part of the new investigation into the cheerleader's disappearance. We did find a length of chain and some Binding clips that uh, Dennis Rader was fond of using for bondage of victims. Authorities spoke to Rader in prison and say he denied killing Kinney, but he also dropped this bombshell. He indicated at the tail end of the interview that uh, one of his uh, favorite fantasies was to kidnap um, a, uh, a, a female victim from a laundromat. Raider's daughter, Carrie Rawson, spoke to News Nation last night and says she recently visited her father in prison, the first time she has seen him in 18 years. He's in a wheelchair. He's pretty much rotting, like, to his core.